guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I thought I would do a little get ready with me and um, have a little chat with you at the same time. This is my second video, so I'm very new to YouTube. So I thought it'd be nice just to have a little chat with you so you could get to know me. Um, I did get up some, oh, <laughs> uh, some questions from YouTuber tag as well. So I thought I might have a look through those and you know, just have a chat with you so you can get to know me so if you would like to watch more and uh watch me put some makeup on this face then just keep watching so today i thought i would just use some products that i picked up in the past two weekends so last weekend i went to a couple of shops and i picked up a couple of bits but the weekend before i went to primark or pennies and i picked up a bit a few bits there you can check that out in my pennies haul that'll be my last and first video so if you want to check that out um i'll link that or you can just you know hop on over um but yeah so today i'm going to use a couple of products from there and a couple of products i got the weekend um so yeah let's begin um for my foundation i'm going to use this one so this is the matte foundation natural medium coverage and it's oil free and this is in the color nude beige i have tried this already it is very light um i actually put some on my neck already <laughs> um not that you would notice at all so as you can see it is very light it does oxidize but i actually got nude beige because I tend to wear tan a lot as you can see I'm really pale I'm not wearing tan at the moment um so I actually got it to mix with tan but it actually pretty much matches my natural skin tone so if you are as light as me it'll work perfectly but if you're darker you want it for tan it won't work at all it does oxidize but not that much like it doesn't get that much darker so yeah um it's a very light consistency which is what i was looking for for the summertime and i thought with it being matte it might be good for um you know when you're sweating in the sun and that kind of stuff as well so yeah welcome to my channel this is my second ever video and there won't be much editing in this video for two reasons one i don't really know how to edit yet um youtube videos so it kind of limits my editing when I don't have that much experience um but it is something I'm learning at the moment and two it kind of works for me anyway because I wanted this to be like a chatty kind of get to know me video so I don't think there's any need for much editing with that but if you do know if how to edit if you are good at editing oh my god my Alex is so red um but yeah, if you're good at editing or anything like that, I would love your recommendations for um, kind of software to use because I don't have a MacBook and all the kind of tutorials I could find were for using iMovie or a MacBook or something like that, um, which I don't have. So um, I would love to know kind of software for Windows um, that I could learn how to make my videos stand out and look really nice for you guys so yeah as you can see this is a really light foundation now to be fair the lights are probably washing it out a lot more as well but even so it looks fairly ghostly from what i can see in the finder here in the camera so yeah i'm wondering if that just looks really casper to you guys but like I said, it will darken up a little bit, slightly. Um, It is very mattifying. Like, I have kind of normal to dry skin. And I can see it's like picking up like dry patches around here. So that's something to be wary about if you have dry skin yourself. Ooh, there we go. So, how's life for you guys? I have been in lockdown now since the wow 16th of march so yes it's been a while and the country's kind of starting to open up now so that's why we've been able to go shopping the past couple of weekends um last weekend 
I only we had to pick up something in Argos so I ended up running into deals as well which we have here in Ireland and I think you have deals in the UK as well because I'm pretty sure I went into one when we were in Wales um oh yeah so this is PS my perfect color liquid concealer medium coverage I actually really like this one it's really nice um but yeah i think you have them in the uk as well but they have a fashion brand called pepco which i actually really really like so i went in there and i got a few bits and pieces you know i'm just gonna use the same brush again um so yeah i picked up a few clothes and things like that in there but you do have to queue now to get into any store really and considering it's been raining all weekend, that was not that much fun. I don't know why, it's like monsoon season. Like, if you look out the window right now, it looks like the middle of November. Like, it's so dark. Um, Which, you know, thank God I have the lights for. But it's so dark outside. There's no way I'd be able to film this at all if I didn't have lights right now. And it's June. Um. So, yeah, how was all your Father's Day? Father's Day was yesterday in Ireland and the UK anyway and maybe the states i'm not sure but i hope you all had a good father's day um i couldn't go and see my father obviously you know for obvious reasons he um he lives like three and a half hours away from me so but we video chatted so it's all good okay so i picked up two new palettes this weekend these ones they're actually from aldi and they're the liqueur range, which I actually love. I love the liqueur range. Um, I, well, I love their skincare. I haven't really tried their makeup. But yeah, so I think they're kind of supposed to be dupes for um, naked palettes. That's it, right. So I used to have the naked palettes before, but um, I had to get rid of them because they, well, basically the cat got into them. And for hygiene reasons, I had to throw them all away, which was really sad. But I saw these and I thought, why not, you know, try them out, give them a go, see what they're like. So I think this one is, it's a natural smoky. So it's probably like the smoky palette. Oh, there we go. So some really nice colors there. And this one is the um intense palette and i think it's supposed to be like the oh what's it called not the cherry palette the the recent one i actually had it i can't remember but you know the one i'm talking about anyway so today i'm gonna go with smoky i think and you know what i think i'm even gonna try out these little brushes that they give give with the palette looks cute um so yeah uh right so i'm just gonna go into this pink lace here just the end i've never tried any of their makeup before so this will be interesting give it a go so uh let's answer a few questions maybe on the youtuber tag um what is your name and the name of your channel the name of my channel is just my name um i've been blogging for about seven years now and when i originally started blogging it was beauty lilinda and then it was lilinda lifestyle and then i decided you know what i'm just going to um use my own name altogether. so that's quite nice it's actually blending lovely it is quite light and quite dusty but I am picking up, picking up good pigment from it and it's blending really nicely. But yeah, anyway, so I started blogging about seven years ago and that was just kind of for myself. It was a little hobby, you know, and it was only to do with makeup. Um, at the time I was in beauty school and I was learning all about makeup and i found youtubing and i found all that and i decided i want to be a part of it but you know being in front of the camera wasn't really my thing i was really shy and things so i did actually attempt a youtube channel a long time ago 
And then I don't know why, but I kind of just gave up on it. Um, it was only a couple of videos. It was nothing major, but um, yeah, I kind of just gave up on it then. So I'm going to, I think I'm going to make this really kind of glittery. So I'm going to take this color that's iron. If you can see this in here. And I'm just going to make it kind of smoky. Hmm. It's really nice. I'm loving how these colors are like blending together. Hmm. But yeah, anyway, so I did YouTube and then I kind of left to go and just kind of kept on with my blogging and things like that. And then recently I was looking into it more again and I was like, oh, I don't know, I kind of want to give it a shot again, give it a try. So, yeah, I decided I was going to start it all up again. Um, in that time, I have also opened up a little Etsy store and I sell handmade knitted items. All the items are personally handmade by myself. So I'll leave a link below if you want to check that out. Um, I know it's June right now, but it does actually feel like winter. So if you're in the mood for a scarf or something, I'll pop it down below. We do have more, oh, I say we, it's just me really, um, have more items than just scarves, you know. So it's not just, um, I think at the moment, yeah, at the moment I have scarves and I have um, headbands as well. And I have a new project coming out very soon. So I'm very excited about that. Um, so okay, the next one I'm going to try is chainmail. We'll try this one, make it start to make it a little bit glittery. Hmm. So, right, ah, oh, that's not really showing up. I don't know if you can see, but. Okay, yeah. It's really light. I mean, can you even see that? I'm going to try my finger. Take no notice of my nail varnish. I need to fix it. That's on my job for tonight. One of my jobs. Okay, so... Yeah, it's definitely better with your finger. Definitely. But it's still really... Yeah, you gotta like pack it in there. So you can kind of see the difference now. Yeah. It doesn't really show up with the brush at all. Hmm. Hmm. Starting to look a bit uh, messy. Okay. So what else can I tell you about myself? Well, I live in Ireland. You can probably tell that by the accent. I'm I'm from Cork, but I live in Kerry, which is about three and a half hours away. But I love it down here. It is so beautiful along the Wild Atlantic Way. Um, I do miss Cork, especially considering I haven't been there for a very, very, very long time now. Um, but I do love it here too. Um, I live with my partner Joe. Now I'm just gonna go into a fossil here. It's like sorry, I don't know if you can see it. Yeah, it's like really silvery. Shows up really bright on the palette, but I'm not sure if it's going to. We'll see. But yeah, I live with my partner Joe and my kitty cat Lola. Which if you follow me on Instagram, you'll see loads of her. Okay, this is actually coming out really like dark look at that can you see that like in the palette it's like really silvery but actually when you put it on your hand it's actually coming out more gold that is so weird look at that and i'm using a different finger so it's it's not actually like mixing with the last with the chain mail at all it's literally it's silver, bright silver, but it's actually gold. That is so weird. Okay, that is not what I wanted. So let's just go into, there's the lighter shade, which is Mallow. 
and I'm just gonna brighten up the corners. I suppose I have to put a little bit actually, just to make it even. Oh, right, right. Um, where was I? Oh yeah, so I live with my little kitty cat Lola and my partner Joe. Uh, we've been together for three and a half, nearly four years now, and we've literally been by each other's side since March <laughs> every single day um, which has actually been really good I thought I would kill him in the beginning to be honest but um, no, it's actually I think it's actually been really good for the, our relationship and stuff I think a lot of people are finding that because I've been talking to a few people and they're saying that it's uh, they found it as well you know that when you're spending so much time together you kind of I don't know it's it's new and it's different it's nice um, right what am I going to do next I am going to leave you go for a second because I can't do eyeliner and that on camera. So I'll be right back to you and hopefully we can make this look a lot better. Okay. Okay, I am back and I have done eyeliner, mascara and tight lining and eyebrows as well. Um, I didn't do lashes because well, I'm not really going anywhere. So, but I will show you my favorite ones. So my favorite ones are the ones from, they're all individual lashes. I much prefer individual lashes to strip lashes. I just think they're more natural looking and they frame the face better. But that's just in my opinion. Um, I know other people have really nice lashes and they do like strip lashes and I don't know how they do it. I know people can like cut them to length and all that. Oh, I can't do that at all. <laughs> I've tried strip lashes, strip lashes so many times and they're like poking into the corner of my eye or they're like too long here and I just, I can't cut them or anything. <laughs> um, but the ones I like anyway, my favorites are the easy lash, um, hashtag ones, or the short lashes from PS range, um, both in pennies or Primark. And they're only 150 each, so you know they do the job so for my eyeliner i use the collection fast stroke i don't know if you can see that properly okay it is not focusing for me okay anyway it is the fast stroke collection eyeliner and that's for my wing and then the mua intense um color in lights out for tight lining that is the right term isn't it yeah and then for my mascara I really like this one it's the fake it from the PS range and that's three euro and I really like that one um it's the second one of this I used uh these are okay they're not my holy grails or anything it's just I needed them when I was in the UK and this is kind of what I could find where I was at the time um what else oh my eyebrows i used this which i love this is my second one of these it is the ps three in one so it has a spoolie in one end it has your um pen on the other it's not a pen color chalk i don't know and then powder here but to be honest i actually never use the powder ever um so yeah now, for my powder, I'm just going to use the PS Perfection Fix Finishing Powder, and that's just in translucent, I believe. Now uh, it doesn't, oh, it does, yeah, translucent. So, yeah, I feel like I haven't been talking that much, to be honest with you. <laughs> um, but if you have any questions or anything, you can just leave them in the comments below. I'd be happy to answer them. It's just, um, yeah, I think... I'm just running out of things to think about, talk about, it, you know. Um, what else? I suppose we have been locked down for ages. Um, so this bronzer I am using is the. <laughs> it's in two halves. Uh, the top came off, but it's the Sunkissed Matte Bronzer. Again, this wasn't. 
isn't like a holy grail or anything it's just that that's what I I needed a bronzer and this was big and matte and it looked like it did the job and it actually yeah it's really good I do like it I don't know if I'll purchase it again um I don't think it does anything outstanding compared to other bronzers but I do really like it definitely does the job if you're looking for a bronzer and it's all affordable as well hmm. so what else do I have to tell you about myself I'm not quite sure to be honest what can you expect from my channel I suppose that'd be a good thing um well with my channel I like to do a lot of um I want to do it to kind of complement my blog so if you are following my blog I'll link it below um I like to do a lot of different lifestyle content so I like to do a lot of um you know gift guides I like to do um beauty self-care motivation I like to do um intentional living and things like that and I mean sometimes you can say oh why would you have intentional living and then shopping but they do complement each other because if you're you know practicing minimalism or intentional living it doesn't mean you never buy anything it just means that when you do buy something well to me it means different things to different people but to me it means that when you do buy something that you're buying it with intention so it doesn't really matter what you're buying or where you're buying it or how you're buying it well how you're buying it i suppose doesn't matter if it's online or in shop or whatever but as long as you're doing it with intention you know that kind of way um but yeah i like to do all different kind of um motivation and you know lifestyle and like productivity goal getting that kind of stuff so it's kind of a bit of a mix of everything and i think i want to bring that to my channel in a way of complimenting my blog because i want to be able to talk to you guys in person and share the things that I have you know that I want to share with you but sometimes when I do that through the blog you can only kind of write so much you know or talk so much about it whereas I feel like here I can chat away to you guys and actually it's kind of a more personal thing you know so this is my Blush I'm using, it's from the PS range, it's kind of wiped off because it's really well loved. But this is in Rosewood, this one. So yeah, you can expect a lot of different types of lifestyle videos, to be honest with you. I mean, I'm not sure if I'm going to niche it down at all or anything like that. Um, because I feel like life has got so much to offer, you know, and I feel like it's kind of a shame to... I mean, you know, there's different people who are, diff who are experts or enjoy different hobbies or different things. But for me, I kind of just want to share all the different things of life, you know. So I don't think I'll be niching it down too much. So I think there will be loads of kind of different stuff for everybody. Um, okay, I'm doing a terrible job of this because I'm talking. <laughs> Anyway, this is, um, oh no, it happened again. Okay, so I bought the, a second one because the bottom of this keeps on coming off and coming into the, going into the top. And I thought it was just because, I thought it was just like the last one just kind of broke or whatever, but it's after doing it again. So I don't think I'll be buying this anymore, but this is Rumor and this is from the PS range. Really like the color, but it uh, breaks a lot, so. And this one is Thrill Seeker. I absolutely love this lipstick. I actually bought two. Okay, I gotta stop talking to them. If you saw in my last video, if you watched my last video, then thank you. I really appreciate it. But you would have seen that I actually bought two backups of it because I just love it so much. Um, especially for autumn winter time. I know now is not that time, even though this look is kind of like an autumn -y, winter dark kind of look. But um, it kind of goes with the weather. Honestly, like it just looks 
so bad outside. <laughs> and apparently in the UK they have um, weather that's hotter than the Bahamas, so that doesn't really seem fair. Um, what other updates? Oh, I booked my hair appointment, um, so that is something I'm looking forward to because that's three weeks away because, you know, they're all booked out. They have to um, take care of all the people they cancelled first, which um, makes sense. It's fair. Um, but yeah, I really do like my hair, although you can't really see it now, but I really do like my hair and I really do like the way it turned out. But I think it needs like hairdressers kind of touch to it, you know, I don't think I'm going to get, well, I probably could get the result I really wanted to if I put a lot more time and, you know, learned more about it. But I do want to go to the hairdresser. I want to get treatment done and I want to get more toning, maybe some highlights or lowlights, make it look really natural. Not quite sure, to be honest, I could go in there and I could completely change my mind and go dark. <laughs> I don't know. But I'm really liking it at the moment and um, yeah, I'm going to have to look online, you know, get a kind of vision going for what I want. Um, anyway, I'll stop rambling. Ooh. Um, I really hope you enjoyed this video. It's uh, like I said, it'll be a second video, so you can expect a lot more to come. And if you have any more questions, because I feel like I didn't really answer any of those questions on um, the YouTuber tag, but if you have any questions, just leave them below and I'll be happy to answer them. So um, please like, subscribe, share, all that stuff. I'll leave the links below to my store and blog and other things, so you can check it all out if you want and if you want to become an email subscriber on my blog i would love that because at the moment i have something exciting coming up and the only people who know about it at the moment are my email subscribers so thank you so much for watching this video and i'll see you in the next one thank you bye